So, but here is the big picture so far. And so, yeah. All right, so today I'm actually gonna show you my tool collection that I've accumulated with the channel. I will say this, this channel used to be called Ryobi Man Caver. I evolved this channel based on what the viewers were telling me to do. All right, I listened to the viewers, this channel evolved to what it is now because the viewers left comments and they wanted to see uh, newer stuff. They wanted to see different brands and they versus videos and you know, like th th that. that's why I do these tests. I do, do this stuff because the viewers actually commented saying that they wanted it and I do, I pretty much do what the viewers say. You guys asked for it, so you guys got it. All right, one thing I didn't do yet though is actually show you the tool collection that I, I've accumulated for the past couple of years for the channel. Now, when I originally got into the Ryobi line, it was to upgrade this house because I used to be a contractor in the early 2000s for new construction before the market crashed. All right, so, so as soon as the market crashed back in 2008, I left the trades and didn't look back. Ryobi is a great brand. I love it. I, I use Ryobi for most of the stuff. But when it comes to drills and impacts, I use another brand. My favorite tool that I have is the Hilti SFD 2A12. And this thing, this little guy is awesome. It's a 12 volt tool. It gets most of what I need to get done around the house. It's able to do six inch specs, you know, and stuff like that. And so if I need a little, something a little bit more powerful, obviously I have the tools to, you know, to get it done. All right, so, but what we are gonna do today, so we are gonna, I'm just gonna uh, show you guys really quick my actual tools that I uh, accumulated. Now, I love all tools, I love all brands, but I do have a favorite specific tool, is that's this one. When it comes to lawn care, I prefer Ryobi, vacuums, Ryobi. I love my six gallon one plus shop vac, that the thing's awesome. I use it for the boat, house here, and if I need to travel with it, I, I, I travel with it. And it actually is a good vacuum for a battery operated vacuum. All right, but like, uh, you know, stuff like that is what I love Ryobi for. All right, so each brand has their own ups and downs, and so that's why I love all tools, because there are, each situation is different for a tool, for a scenario. All right, now I'll give you guys an example for the Milwaukee Fuel M18 impact driver. This impact driver releases bits from the collet, which is not good. This is not this is not a safe impact driver. It's the most powerful, and it's the, it's uh, it's very compact. But that collet is a big deal because if you're pulling on something and you're on a ladder, your your momentum of breaking that is just you you're you could fall off the ladder. If it, that's dangerous. All right, but so like each of the, my point is each brand has their ups and downs. All right, so, uh, and so yeah, so let's just take a little tour of, uh, of my wall and yeah. So I just wanna show you really quick uh, my wall now, just keep in mind that this is not all of my tools. This is just what I have in the garage. I bought so many tools and gave them away. I bought tools for my actual job. You know, I gave like, a, and so I gave some as gifts. And so, yeah, these are just the tools that I have in the garage, which it's actually pretty crazy. And more and more is gonna be coming. I've been uploading videos, videos for the past two years, but the way that it's going now, I've only been uploading these types of videos for a year and a half. So if I'm not, this channel is doing great, thanks to you guys for, you know, within a year and a half. That, that, to me, that's, that's not too shabby at all. All right, but let's take a tour really quick. All right, so this is what it looks like now. It's Halloween, uh, it's oct the middle of October, so I put some lights up, I got my jack-o'-lantern there, and so yeah, so this is my, this is, so this is what my shop looks like right now. Got the pack-out system, I got the Ryobi propane right here, which the, which this is actually, a, another review is coming on this. I love this thing because, it, I'll tell you guys why when the video comes out, Got the floor dryer right here. I use that a lot at, at home and work. Got the DeWalt cordless flex volt compressor. This thing is awesome. I have, I cannot believe I haven't done a video on this yet. We got the Ryobi vacuum, which Hilti makes a vacuum sort of like this, which I want the Hilti one. Got the 10 inch table saw, which I'm actually gonna sell this. I wanna get the Milwaukee 10 inch table saw because I want a mixture of stuff. I got the I got the Ryobi 36 volt uh, 
miter saw right there, which I love that thing. It's very powerful. And that's only up there right now because I'm going to put that right here as soon as I get more uh, shelving brackets. But this is where I have the high voltage hammer drills. I got Milwaukee, Cobalt, DeWalt, DeWalt, Milwaukee. Sorry, I got Makita, Cobalt, DeWalt, Milwaukee, Cobalt, DeWalt, Ryobi, DeWalt, Rigid, Makita, DeWalt. Yeah, I have, when it comes to hammer drills, I have more DeWalts than anything else. Yeah, so this is where I have the single-handed and regular recip saws. I got the impact wrenches right here, which I need more. I need more impact wrenches. This is where I have the impact drivers. I got DeWalt, Milwaukee, Ryobi, Makita, Ryobi, Milwaukee, Rigid, Cobalt, Craftsman, Rigid, DeWalt, Makita, Fake Makita, Ryobi, 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 those two are brushless. Those are, in my opinion, those are garbage. Kimo is actually pretty good, the brushless impact driver. I cannot believe I haven't done another video on that. I only did one. So, th so that is that, this wall. And then here is my 12 volt tools. Well, this is going to expand big time. This is going to expand big time. I need to get more Bosch. This is where I keep my Hilti. Hilti, I decided to, to just have it all by itself. So I got some 12 volt tools. 22 volt, 22 volt, 22 volt, 12 volt, 22 volt. So that, that's just uh, plain that, so that's just Hilti. All right, then I got the regular drill drivers here. I got Ryobi, Makita, DeWalt, Cobalt, Milwaukee, Popeman, DeWalt, Milwaukee, Ryobi, Rigid, and Hart, which this drill is actually, it, for what it is, it actually impresses me. And then I got my staple. Uh, Brad's, uh, my staple guns right here, which I want to get to uh, Milwaukee and DeWalt staple gun as well. Sorry, Brad nails. Got just one heat gun. I already did a video between this and the Milwaukee. It's, it's the same tool. They operate the same. And so, yeah. Uh, what else? Lawnmower. You got some vacuum, uh, some hand vacs. The heart is for the boat. The boat will be winterized soon. This one's for the shop. Got my lawn stuff, which I got to, uh, like I said, I just rearranged all this. Uh, I still got to fill this space up. And I got random tools up there. I got Cobalt, Ryobi, Heart. I got to put my pressure washer back up here. It's in the car because I used it at work today. I got, I got my, the air cannon. Please join Ryobi Rebels, the Facebook group. At, um, almost at 10,000 members. Got my Ryobi air cannon. I use that every day. Got the shop vac. I love my uh, 18 volt shop vac. This thing is actually awesome for what it is. I will sacrifice power for portability. That thing is awesome. It's powerful enough to do exactly what I want it to do. So, but here is the big picture so far. Oh, I got my bandsaw right there. I want to get the Hilti bandsaw too. And so, yeah. All right, so I just want to show you guys the new setup really quick. So if you like the new setup, please leave it in the comments below. And if you like the old setup, please also leave that in the comments below. Me, personally, I love this new setup. I, I seriously do, which, uh, <clears throat> which next fall, it's going to change again. I, so, I, so I figured that I need to change certain stuff, you know, like once a year to just change it up a little bit so it's not the same thing over and over and over again. And so, yeah, so at least now you guys get to, you know, have a different background. So that's pretty much it. Like I said, please leave it in the comments below if you like this setup or if you like the old setup. I will reply to your comment. I reply to every single comment that is, I reply to every single first initial comment from someone since I started the channel. Every single comment is answered. I, it, one thing that is hard to do, it is hard to reply to a reply. Because it is, uh, uh, it's hard to track that. And so those are the ones that get left behind. But your first initial comment, I always like heart and I comment back. So that's pretty much it. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. And I'll see you guys next time.